Thank you very much. So my name is Ruben Hünig. I'm co-founder and CEO of Phytonics. Solar panels, as you know, they provide carbon-free electricity. But this does not mean that they are emission-free. In fact, they produce a new type of emission, which is glare. The sun is extremely bright, and, uh, but it shines from above. So in our everyday life, that's not such a problem for us. But the reflections from the solar panels, which are also extremely bright, they directly come into our um, field of view. And much brighter than this flashlight, actually. So this is a big problem in many situations. <clears throat> for example, in neighborhoods where um, people just want to enjoy the view out of uh, their terrace and there's a reflection over several hours a day. Um, this causes many, many legal issues. We get requests on a daily basis where homeowners have just installed their PV panels and the next day the neighbor arrives and complains heavily. And the stupid thing is that the PV owner has not only PV panels, but he has also bought a heat pump, an electric car, and maybe a battery package. So with losing his PV, uh, his whole energy concept is obsolete. And also in other areas, like around airports and highways, glare is a real problem. And already today, you need a glare assessment to get the building permit for photovoltaics around airports and highways, and also around railways. And in roughly 50% of the cases, the glare assessment is negative. So, and we have so many airports in Europe and we have so long highways, which means that there's a huge area potential blocked by glare. And since these areas are very well suited for um, power generation, I mean, you cannot do anything else with them. It's really a pity if you don't use it. So we have developed a solution which makes solar panels absolutely glare-free, and therefore you just need to add our bio-inspired anti-glare coating. And since there is no good solution on the market yet, we get requests on a daily basis from all segments of the photovoltaic uh, um, uh, area, and for example, rooftop owners, but also large installers, project developers, and so on and so forth, airports. And without having done any marketing efforts, we have collected requests for more than 1.5 million coatings. And since they have all, the, all, the, the customers have um, one in common, which is um, that without our solution, the project won't be realized. Or even worse, the existing installation has to be removed. So you can imagine how huge the pain is. And this brings us in a comfortable situation, which means that we will be able to reach break-even at the end of this year, and, but to, to accelerate um, and really make an impact, we are looking into the option to raise a Series A for pure growth capital. And uh, yeah, we would be happy to get in talks to you about this option. Thank you very much.